If I were the teacher of this class, I'd say, now boys and girls, let's just stand and stretch because I know you're tired and sleepy. But anyway, since I'm not the teacher, I'll just have to go on to do this. Uh, my name is Ruth Kimball Council. I would like to consider myself as a friend of Valdosta City Schools. Why? Because I taught there for 30 years as a teacher, as a curriculum director, as a principal. I retired in 1987, but my interest in boys and girls did not retire. I'm profoundly interested in our children and their progress. Particularly am I interested in those minority students that are falling between, between the cracks. I make no apology for my profound interest in our black students, minority students, in our Valdosta City School System. When I was asked to become a member of this committee, oh, I was so excited because I was going to be, I was given an opportunity to do something that would be meaningful for our educational system in Valdosta and Niles County. <clears throat> Is this the best thing that ever happened to me? I don't know. I won't say that. But I do know that it is good that we have come together as citizens, city and county, to talk about education of our boys and girls. Now, my grandmother taught me a very valuable lesson. She said, you can talk all you want to, but a person convinced against his will is of the same opinion still. So hopefully you won't be of the same opinion when you leave here tonight. Perhaps you'll be able to be flexible and you'll think and you'll reflect on what this uh, Friends of Valdosta City School said, children's education first. I think we all can agree with that. Their education should be our main concern. That certainly is mine. I'm not here to defend. I'm here to say amen. And you know when you say amen, that means you agree. So I agree with the fact that we do need to do something that will reform our educational system. You and I know that our students are not achieving as we would like for them to achieve. They are doing better, but better is not enough. We're working for best. It is our belief that if we come together with one focus, one priority, that we will improve the educational system in our community. But if we don't, let's continue to love one another. Let's work together for the good of the boys and the girls and for the good of our community. But most importantly, for the uh, good of our Heavenly Father. Now, I think I, I don't need to repeat everything that has 